Hi, my name is Matthew Peasy. I'm going to show you how you can edit a portrait inside of Photoshop. One of the reasons you may want to edit a portrait inside of Photoshop is so you get the best possible image. Every image that you're going to edit inside of Photoshop will have different needs. For this particular image, I want to make sure that I'm getting the best possible color reproduction. In Photoshop CS5 in later versions, you can go up to the image menu. And under the image menu, you have several controls for modifying the color's appearance. The easiest way to modify its appearance is to use these auto controls. You'll notice that there's a command for auto color, auto contrast, and auto tone. I think this image would benefit from all three commands. So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and choose auto contrast. It may take a moment for Photoshop to analyze and apply this command, but once it's done, you'll notice that the image has much better contrast. I'm going to go ahead and do the exact same thing for auto tone and auto color. After adjusting the image's color, you may find blemishes in the subject. In this case, there's a blemish on the model's chin. I want to go ahead and remove that. To remove it, I need to zoom into the blemish. The easiest way to zoom in is to use a keyboard shortcut. On the Mac, it's Command Spacebar. If you're on the window side, you'll hold down the control key and the space bar and click into that area. Once you've zoomed into the blemish, come over to the tools panel and choose the spot healing brush. With this tool, you'll simply click on the blemish and it will magically disappear.